kind of slugs. The guy just got back from doing my mandatory duty. That's right, I voted. Hello, little one. Hello, sweet one. How you doing? Yep. I did all that. Now I'm heading up to QT to grab me a complimentary free donut. And and a and a tea do their to book the coupons but just as I was leaving somebody calls out and I wasn't paying that much attention and it turned out to be somebody I used to work with over at Sears and the sad thing is I can't think of her name And, yeah, I cannot for the life of me think of what the gal's name is. <laughs> Shit. She had this little dog that she rescued several, like, 17, 18 years ago when the child, when the dog was around six-ish. That's how they were going to be 18 come January. I said, damn. But nonetheless... I just want to do this quick, quick vlog about the election day. All polls, of course, end at 7. Of course, when I got there, the A through I line was, was quite short. But the J through, J through uh, Z line, which, of course, I would be in, was quite long. Giggity, giggity. Thank you, Quagmire. But no, all kidding aside, this is what should happen. I voted for the appropriate side. I'll just say that much, I won't say who. I voted for the pro appropriate side because the opposite side apparently wants to walk around. Okay, I'm gonna say it. I voted for all Republicans as far as I know. Uh, and then, cause there's that last half, which last bottom half, which doesn't uh, state the, their, uh, their affiliation. And I, I had the sheet which stated who everybody was. And I, of course, left it at home. I should have, I wanted to check my phone, but cause I had it there too, but I didn't think they would very much appreciate that so but nonetheless yeah I voted practically straight Republican because we all know how the Democrats are they'll pick your pocket and then blame the opposite side for doing so but I will say this much with all the crap that happened these past years the border crisis, the the inflation, the condemic, which I'm going to continuously call, along with the convid, the way they want to push this, the way they want to push this over-sexualization towards our kids from kindergarten on up. And they have book readings with have book readings with cross dressers and take them take our children to freaking strip strip clubs. Personally I think any parent that does that, either one of those, they should be arrested. And the place should be closed down.
as well as the parent should be charged with endangerment. Same way with teaching these kids that in school that their skin color is, is teaching their skin color is is a violation. That is also that is mental abuse and those parents that those teachers should be kicked out but anyway I digress but what I'm about to say here is when the Republicans get in both houses we stuck we voted for you people because you claimed you had grown a pair you, you assured us that when we were voting for you and that you were campaigning, that you honestly grew a pair. Which means once you get into office, do not, do not continue on with this taking the high road. Do not, do not continue taking this, let's turn the other cheek, bullshit. I'll be quite honest, because if that's all you're going to continue on doing is turning the other cheek when you knew full well that the Democratic Party, the left, was basically stripping people of their rights, in other words, claiming, oh, we're for, we're for free speech, but if you're if what you're saying doesn't coincide with what we're saying, we're gonna ban you from whatever social media site. So, all I'm saying is, we voted for you folks to have a pair of balls to go against those people that were attacking the opposite side, the conservative side in every which way, shape, and form. But if you're gonna continue on with this, like I said, this turning turning the other cheek and taking the high road, then why the fuck even bother running? It never ceases to amaze me. So, that was my two cents. I'm your blind dyslexic. Ciao for now. You've been watching TBD on with your host the blind dyslexic. He does other casts such as Tulsa walkabouts along with the everything show and the real who the ends with Matrix Lower 212. Thank you for watching. Ciao for now.